everyone and welcome back to my channel in today's video i am going to be doing another valentine set for you guys so let's just go ahead and get started as you can see i've already applied my tips now i'm just clipping away the edges that way i don't have to file as much i am going for a stiletto shape today and we are gonna go pretty long i think this is the longest i've ever had my nails Alright, now that I've clipped away the edges, now I'm just going to take my hand file and finish shaping them up. Here they are all shaped up. Now I'm going to take my dehydrator from OPI and my primer from No Lift Nails and dehydrate and prime my nails. And yes, I had already prepped my natural nail beds before the video. Next, I'm taking Mia Secrets Natural Pink and putting a thin base on all of my nails. For our first nail, we are going to be using these glitter heart sequins. I'm going to be using this sort of like dark pink with this pretty reflective colors. So I'm first starting off by putting a thin kind of wet-ish layer onto the nail just so that the glitter has something to stick to. And I'm sorry about the shaking. I kept knocking my light, which made my light knock my 
camera stand and yeah sorry but anyway yeah I'm just grabbing some of those heart glitters and just placing them on the nail Now I'm taking another bead of that pink and putting it over to encapsulate those, but also so our next layer will have something to stick to. I did it like this because I wanted it to have dimension so that when you look at the nail, once it's done, you can see that there's some underneath and some on top, you know, like different layers, if that makes sense. Hopefully it does. I'm, I'm sure some of y'all get what I'm talking about. Okay, now once I've got all of those placed, I'm now going to encapsulate with that same Mia Secret Natural Pink color. For our next nail, I'm taking this darker pink color. It's still see-through, but it is darker than the natural pink. And I'm putting a thin layer on my index finger. The reason I'm putting a thin layer is because I'm going to put a glitter over it. And I want that nail to, to still have a pink base to it. And I had only done one layer, but I do go back and add another layer just to make it more vibrant, I guess. And I'm sorry I forgot to show what brand that pink is from, but I can try to find it and link it below. I got it from a friend, so we'll see. And I also have no idea what the brand of this glitter pink color is. I used this one in my last video, um, and yeah, I don't know what the brand is. I also got that one from the same friend, and there's no sort of labeling on it, so sorry about that, guys. But it is like a sheer um kind of pink base with silver glitter in it anyway i'm just doing a thin layer of that glitter also and like i said i'm gonna i end up leaving it like this because i wasn't sure if i wanted to add more but i do end up adding more later now moving on to the pinky i am using that same pink color and just doing that nail in the full pink <laughs> Oh, 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 oh,
Now I'm going back in and adding that second layer of the pink and glitter to the index finger. And I'm so glad I did that because it definitely made it look a lot better. And I'm still keeping these layers pretty thin because I am going to encapsulate in that same Mia Secret powder. For our middle finger, we are going to do a sort of ombre situation. So first I'm starting off by putting a thin wet layer of that clear pink and then adding some of the glitter pink hearts. Next, I'm going to encapsulate those hearts before moving on to our next step, just so that the hearts don't move around too much. Next, I'm grabbing my glitter color and I'm going to blend that down over the hearts, only taking, putting it in about the middle of the nail. Next, I'm taking that dark pink color and putting it on the nail bed and blending that over the glitter color. And originally, I wasn't sure how this nail was going to turn out. I wasn't sure if it was going to look good or not, but I actually ended up loving the way it looks. It might be my favorite nail out of the set, to be honest. Look at that, so pretty. Next, I'm gonna take that Mia Secret color and encapsulate that whole nail. And now for the thumb, I'm just going to do it the same way that I did the pinky, just the full colored pink.
and here are the nails all done so now let's get on to shaping I'm first starting off with this medium grit uh, ceramic bit and going around the cuticle and over the entire nail just to smoothen it out Now I'm taking my hand file and further shaping up the nails. they are all shaped up just giving you a side profile look at that apex now I'm taking my Kiara Sky non wipe top coat and top coating all the nails and I love this part because you get to see all the glitter come to life Here they are all top coated and I'm going to let that cure for 30 seconds. And this is the final look you guys. I love them so much. What do you guys think? I feel like these are some of the prettiest nails that I have ever done. Uh, I love the way they turned out. I really do. I wanted my Valentine's set to scream Valentine's. Like when you think Valentine's, this is something you would think of, right? Anyway, that's it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you'll consider subscribing and giving this video a thumbs up. And don't forget to turn on your notifications be bells. That way you don't miss another upload. And I'll see you guys in my next one.